Good morning everyone. Hi, it's Karen here from Eden Secret. Welcome back. Uh, back onto a few cupcakes now. Um, and these ones are in my botanical range of cupcakes and these are my jasmine cupcakes. And as you see, they are sprinkled with chamomile heads. Now chamomile is very, very healing and soothing on the skin and they're gorgeous in the bath um once you get the water soaked into them some people might think this is awful but i like to squidge them between my fingers and sm smother them onto my skin um i just love chamomile it's beautiful so i just thought i would unmold them for you as ever, when you're making cupcakes and you put sprinkles on the top, more fall off than stay on. So, as you can see, they have a... It's actually meant to be yellow, but I hope the colour's going to change. But obviously, the, the fragrance oil is quite yellow as well, so it has made it rather peachy rather than yellow, but that's not a bad thing. Still looks nice. It actually looks more yellow inside and just peach on the outside where the air's hitting it. They're all the same. And I've just put a little paper rose in the top as well. Oh, guess what I did this morning? I don't know if any of you have ever done this, but oh my God, it's one of the worst things you can do with lye. I was stirring my lye water and a little bit of it splashed up and somehow it managed to get right down in the back of my nail. And what's so annoying about that is once it's in there, you can't get it out, even though you rinse it and rinse it and rinse it um, so what I actually did was I got some neat lavender essential oil and I just uh, squirted a bit of it down the back of my nail and I got something to push it the lavender down and it is hurting very very slightly at the moment but most of the pain is gone so I don't know if any of you have ever done that, but oh, that does hurt. So there you go. That's all of them unmolded. And as I said, you'll find these in the botanical range of cupcakes. If you buy them on the website, they all come prettily wrapped in clear cellophane with matching ribbon and gift tag. So I hope to see you next time. Next, I'm going to be unmolding my angel cake. Also, I'm going to be picking the winner of the guess or choose a name for my purple alien cake. Um, I've written all of my favourites down up to now, but I thought I might actually just leave it on for one more day to give everybody a chance to put their ideas down um, but I've seen some awesome names some names I've loved but I've wanted to change them slightly just slightly um, but we'll see um, and we'll see who the winner is wherever you are in the world it could be you I'll see you next time bye for now